Great Bubble Barrier is a social enterprise that has developed a bubble barrier uh, and this system is able to capture plastic trash in rivers with nothing but air bubbles like you see behind me. The way it works is that we place a perforated tube diagonally on the bottom of the river and then we have an electric compressor pump air through that tube and through all these tiny little holes in the tube we create an air bubble curtain. And this curtain is able to lift up plastic that's underwater to the surface and then together with all the trash that's already on the surface it's all being pushed to the side and then into the catchment system from what it, where the trash is then removed from the water. We have now implemented here our first system outside the Netherlands in Portugal in the city of Vila do Conde as part of the Maelstrom project, uh, the largest European funded project on the reduction of marine litter in our oceans. Uh, luckily, electricity can be produced by sustainable means and uh, our role was to provide uh, panels, solar panels, to make the system as sustainable as possible. Uh, in an ideal world, it would be 100% sustainable and we would uh, produce everything by solar energy. But even if it's not 100%, we can still uh, help make it more sustainable by reducing the amount of electricity it has to use. O estado do rio, aqui do rio Ave, realmente quando nós fizemos uma avaliação do estado ecológico, mas também da quantidade de lixo que tem este rio, realmente nós verificamos que era uma quantidade muito significativa, tanto de plásticos visíveis, plásticos grandes, como também dos microplásticos, que são um problema que nós não vemos bem, mas que entra na cadeia trófica e acaba muitas vezes na nosso, nos nossos alimentos, naqueles alimentos que tiramos do mar. O CIMAR está, fez a avaliação da qualidade ecológica antes de começar, antes deste, deste equipamento ser colocado aqui e agora vamos, vamos ver qual é digamos assim, o resultado, portanto, qual é as diferenças que nós conseguimos encontrar depois do equipamento começar a funcionar. Vamos fazer um ano de monitorizações que se podem estender até mais no tempo para vermos de que forma é que o ecossistema melhora e que, de que forma é que realmente nós vemos a redução de, da quantidade de plásticos na, tanto no rio como nas zonas costeiras. I'm also proud that the Altaris could play a role in this. We have also made a numerical model together with CIMAR. And I've been looking at so many figures of this estuary, how the flow is, how the ecological, how the ecological assessment, what it looks like. And um, yeah, now finally at this lounge, we can really see how the estuary is. And I'm really um, excited that it is uh, so nice in the water, that it looks so nice in the water, but also the surroundings of the estuary, they are great. I'm happy that, uh, that Deltaris could play a role in this. The project Maestrom uh, is contributing from the very beginning to the EU mission uh, Restore Our Ocean Waters by 2030 and to the global effort uh, to address the issue of marine litter. Here we are here, you see uh, on my back uh, the bubble barrier, which is one of the technology that the Maestrom project has developed to uh, address this problem. The bubble barriers uh, di diverged the litter and coll it's collected in this container that you see here to be uh, taken away from the environment before it reaches the ocean. Because once it reaches the oceans, we know that it's very difficult to be collected again. And uh, so this is uh, a, a very important technology that we would like to have here and uh, replicate in other places to really uh, achieve the, the EU, EU uh, mission, the Sora Ocean Waters uh, objectives, that is to reduce marine pollution by 50% by the 2030.